Blue. <laughs> blue does not want to share with Blue Duck. Hi, this is Bob Shelton, and we're looking at horse sense today. Uh, that you trust in the Lord, I have made known to thee this day, even to thee, have not I written to thee excellent things in counsel and knowledge, that I may make you know the certainty of the words of truth, that thou mightest answer the words to truth to them who send unto you. Now, that's a little complicated verse. God is saying to um, the prophets, to the teachers, I've given you all you need. I have given you truth. I have given you certainty of the words of that truth that you might be able to answer them in truth. Truth today is up for grabs. Truth today is up for anybody's perspective. Truth today is called relative because uh, they don't want an absolute moral truth. Even our politicians, I'm convinced, do not want moral absolute truth. When, when they say, for instance, that they're concerned about uh, confirming a judge on the Supreme Court because she's a Catholic, well, most of them on there are Catholics now. What they're actually saying is, we don't want a Christian on the Supreme Court who is going to rule against Roe v. Wade and, and come and knock abortion out in this country. In fact, uh, Judge Barrett mentioned the word sexual preference, and they um, stopped the, the confirmation hearings and chided her for using such an archaic term as sexual preference. They said, don't you understand that that is offensive to the LBGQT uh, crowd? That, uh, that is very offensive. You're actually saying with that, Judge Barrett, that they made a choice to be this, and they looked as though they were as serious as they could be. And here's my point. God has given us truth, and he's given us the explanation of truth, and he's made it available to us so that it should be just as Judge Barrett said that it was. This is how it is. This is truth. But they looked at truth and turned their nose up at it. That's where our culture is today. That's where many, many of our leaders are today in a cultural, non-moral, absolute condition that no word has any other power over any other word. Hey, this is Bob Shelton, and that's Horse Sense.